This is a News 2 update, the Millennium Celebration. Happy New Year. You're looking live at Times Square, where millions of people welcome in the year 2000 and the new millennium, seven minutes and 47 seconds <laughs> ago. Good evening. Good morning. I'm Dana Tyler. I'm Stephen Clark. We are happy to tell you that all indications are now in the early going. The biggest party of the century in Times Square went off with a very few, if any, problems. It's been a great night. News 2 reporter Lou Young is live in Times Square with more in the very loud area. It's, uh, Lou. <laughs> hey, what were we worried about? Yeah, okay. really? It came and went. And oh, it's already calming down, believe it or not. For a while, you couldn't even see uh, the other side of Times Square because of all the confetti that fired out of those cannons as a midnight approached here. And people who had waited, some for 10, 12, 14 hours, uh, just exploded in a, a frenzy of congratulation and celebration here. And already people are starting to file out of Times Square. Uh, right before the, um, uh, the midnight hour hit, uh, some police barricades were breached here uh, at 46th Street as a, a couple of hundred people rushed into Times Square, into the uh, frozen zone uh, areas to uh, see this. But the police held them and it went without uh, without too much pushing and shoving. And uh, and we just sat through this thing and listened to the uh, Auld Lang Syne play, Auld Lang Syne play and uh, watched the spectacle. Uh, it is really uh, still rocking and rolling here, as you can see. People are enjoying themselves. They are uh, savoring the moment. A lot of these folks said that uh, they weren't really enjoying standing in the cold for all these hours, but they wanted to be able to say that they were here when the millennium changed. And every one of these people, a million or more, uh, we guess, uh, will be able to say that to their uh, children and grandchildren for years to come. I was in Times Square when the year 2000 arrived. Uh, there was only a half a dozen or so arrests, uh, seven arrests about uh, an hour or so ago. There may have been a few more since then. But uh, as these things go, it is a pretty uh, low key and uh, pretty festive. And uh, we're just enjoying the year 2000. Back to you guys. Uh, we're all here. Nothing, nothing happened. Nothing went wrong. Okay. Excellent. Thanks, Lou. Times Square isn't the only place in Manhattan where there's a big New Year celebration going on. Thousands of people are going for a midnight run in Central Park. It's a tradition. News to reporter Sukanya Christian joins us live. Sukanya. Hey, Stephen and Dana, Happy New Year's. What an amazing party that's going on right here at Central Park. Of course, the Midnight Millennium 5K Run. Just take a look over here. Uh, fireworks were going off. Let's just wait. There you go. You Look at that burst into the air to celebrate the millennium. The year 2000 is here. The runners, I don't know if you can see, there's about 10,000 runners over my shoulder who are going to be doing a 5k run over here just to give you an idea of what's going on here this couple just got engaged sean and denise and denise how do you feel um very excited i'm just happy very happy dana steven it was pretty amazing to watch her face uh she just didn't even know it was coming he, sean got up All on right. me and there it goes take a look at the fire <laughs> thanks Sukanya. She'll still be talking tomorrow morning. Oh, wonderful out there in the park. Uh, that wraps up our New Year's coverage. We would like to thank you for joining us in this entire last millennium and so far this one. I'm Stephen Clark. I'm Dana Tyler. Happy New Year from all of us at News 2. Good night. See ya.